The United Nations and the World Bank tells us that the riots around the world were caused not by politics or religion, but by the rising cost, the record high prices of food around the world. And that is caused by the record high prices of water. Water is becoming more valuable because we are overusing it and there's simply so much population that it overwhelms the current water supply. We think, Cornucopia Enterprises thinks, that the future of the world, the future of our nation over the next 10, 20, 30 years is going to be based on good water management and new, more reliable, more efficient food production systems. We have developed a program whereby a greenhouse can be powered with solar panels, wind turbines to provide the electricity for fans or lining, and also to produce organic foods using drip irrigation at a third or a half of the current cost and also extend the growing season so that you can grow maybe two or three crops when you normally could only grow one. The other advantage is that these greenhouses can be put near cities, near urban centers where you don't have to ship a tomato 2,000 miles or pick it green and spray it with chemicals in order to make it look ripe. Cornucopia Enterprises has cornucopia greenhouses of all sizes for agriculture and backyard production. Plus, the doctors tell us that fresh organic food is better for you, helps you to lose weight, will help you fight disease, and essentially is better for you and your family. Perhaps now it is time for you to really consider growing your own. Sonny Booth with cornucopia-enterprise.com is on a national crusade to encourage better food production techniques by using unproductive land in areas that are short of water and putting in greenhouses or high tunnels to create three seasons a year of food and to be able to produce food as well as save water, energy, help the environment and as well create an inexpensive supply of food for our world. There are some areas where hot summer weather or cold freezing weather eliminates growth possibilities. This can cure that. This farm in New Mexico has been growing organic raspberries for over 40 years. They don't put chemicals on them. You don't see any uh, chemical sprays. You can eat these right off the vines and they have something to teach us. But even in this area where it gets sometimes 20 or 30 below in the wintertime could double or triple its production with greenhouses. Organic berries. I just picked them up right here in an open farm located in New Mexico. This morning I was looking at the data about the world population. According to the Washington, the recent study shows by the end of this year, 2011, world population will grow to 7 billion. This is almost twice in 1999. What we are going to do with that number? 7 billion people. We have limited supply of water and food. There is not that much alternative left. In this case, this farmer used to sprinkle, but now he's using this way. You use less water, food production going down because of the development close by the cities and the price of water going up and of course price of food increasing. Now, the increasing price of the food and water and of course unless agricultural land in production is going to lead us to a major crisis. Now, this brings us to a very good conclusion. This farm has only one growing season, but this is not enough. The alternative is increasing the number of growing seasons. 
Th this goal is approachable by using a greenhouse, irrigated system run by the power of sun or wind, equipped with solar panels or a small wind turbine, irrigated system, and a soil heating system. Bring them all together is going to provide a good environment to grow berries all year around with much lower effective cost. The reason they only get two months growing season is because of the condition of the weather here. Snow in the winter, hot wind and drought in the summer. The same farmer can double or triple his production by using an enclosed system of the greenhouse. Okay. The USDA research states that the average greenhouse makes five to seven dollars per square foot per average greenhouse per year. So this farmer can simply quadruple his profit by using an average agricultural high tunnel in this field or four times the profit by using a greenhouse and plus he uses less water and he produces organically which everyone loves it including myself the prices of food going up every day all around the world that's the reason it causes a riot this berries is cost five dollars per pound because they are organic and they sell it at least six or seven dollars per pound in the organic stores this farmer can easily product three times and sell it for less and is still making better profits Cornucopia Greenhouse is on a crusade to teach the farmers how to increase their production, how to develop more production, more food production in a greenhouse by using the irrigated system. These berries are going to be shipped 700 miles. Think about how much transportation cost we can save by producing them locally in the edge of the cities and save all that money and of course the fuel and energy and also have fresher produce. The world is at a crossroads in food production. World riots around the world because of high prices of food and shortages of water are causing us to rethink how we grow our foods. Farmers and agriculture Experts all over the world say with all the unused land and non-productive land because of the lack of water could well be turned into the most profitable land of all by use of high tunnels and greenhouses. This could be a revolution because we can put these near cities. We can save water. We can save energy by use of wind and solar energy to pay for the irrigation for the water and the entire world could produce three times as much food at perhaps a half or maybe a third the present cost. This is a future. It's good for us. It's healthy. It's good for the world. I didn't know picking up the berries can be this much fun. Look at here. But there's a trick to pick them up without uh, squishing them. Um, you only pick up the ripen one and gently you just pull it off the stem here we go and they are ready to bake make a pie can freeze. these are organic can you, can you eat it can you eat it right on the spot yes yes as a matter of fact i have done a lot show me one sure let me mm. oh mm -mm -mm. right here <laughs> look at this branch Be, can go right into the mouth. What you say? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Look at now, is that how you do it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's totally organic. Mm -hmm.
No chemicals. No chemical. Mm. It's grown naturally. Uh, think what this guy could do if he were going with uh, drip irrigation, mm -hmm. with the irrigation powered by solar and wind. <laughs> He'd be better off. We'd have more berries. Yes. The world is going to need to be progressive in its farming. And farmers, you know, are conservative. But they also get it, too. I think uh, the farmers will get it. Medical doctors say fresh vegetables and food contain more vitamin than preserved and the canned one. They also contain more beta and mega ingredients for rejuvenation and they also contain more antioxidant beta and mega ingredients for promoting longer and healthier lifestyle. And this is the end of our adventure. I'm tired and I might get sunburned, but I'm so happy. Look at all of this fresh, organic, healthy food production that me and Ben picked up. Can it, we're gonna make pies, we're going to freeze it, we're going to make syrups, jam, but I might even make a Persian dish instead of cherries. I think I can use berries <laughs> and make a delicious al balu polo. I'm Venus. And I'm Mars. Until the next time. Visit us at www cornucopia-enterprise. Give us a call. Buy a greenhouse today and produce your own healthy organic food.